What's up? Good. I know Phil said Richie couldn't help, but, I mean, she must have other legal beagles working for her. Ben, is it just Richie, or does your dad have a bunch of people that can get him off all of his crimes and stuff? We use Richie for the legitimate businesses, but, yes, she's part of a bigger firm. Why? Ben. Brief like that will cost a ball. Yeah, well, I'm still working on the fighting fund. Yeah, I know, and I appreciate that, son. We're talking silly money here. I am going to go down for something that I didn't do. The sooner we all get our heads around that, the better. Ah, oh, Freddy. So, this is the rotor, and I've marked all your shifts in red. So, for every red square, I need to come in and work? Yeah. Is that, is that OK? That's a lot of red squares, Bob. That's how a job works. <laughs> all right. You're funny. I love it. No problem. Great. I'll see you tomorrow. Here, Kath, look at this. He's a genius. Yeah. Takes after me. <laughs> all right, mate. Cooking the books. What do you want? Look, it's a bit awkward, but... I need to borrow a little bit of money from my dad's lawyer. This legal aid guy, he's a joke. And why have you come to me? Because, Phil, you're minted. I ain't seen that many numbers since my maths GCSE. <clears throat> and you're my family. Double bubble. You marry my auntie Kat and you're my step-uncle and my fifth cousin. Eight times removed or whatever. And is this a loan? Look, Phil, I'll take whatever I can get, cos if I don't... He's going to go down and probably die in prison. Come on, Phil. Now they've got a witness case against him as well, just the odds are not looking good. Listen, uh, sorry, no. I don't like what's happening to Billy any more than you. But... Well, Richie ain't an option. All my money's tied up at the moment, so... Sorry, there's nothing I can do. It's nice that you tried, Freddie. It'll mean a lot to Billy. Yeah, well, of course I tried. He's my dad. Look, she's texting me about trainers. You're after me for cash and all. I mean, I'll give you enough every month, don't I? Oh, she's your daughter, Ben. Do you love her? Yes, I love my daughter. All right, all right, all right. Come round later. I'll give you some cash. What? What, so Mitchells have only got money when it suits them, then? It's only my dad's facing life behind bars, and your dad is too tight to help him. Well, since when? Well, since he told me he won't pay for a better lawyer. <laughs> Look, my dad's short of hair and he's short of charm, but he ain't short of cash. Well, why won't he do something to help my dad? Come on, we both know prison's gonna break him. Your dad even knows that. All right, leave it with me. So what, you just couldn't be bothered to help him then? I mean, that's what it comes down to, didn't it? We all about? You told me you were strapped for cash, and then Ben goes and sorts it within a phone call. He's done what? Sweet talk to some guy called Jimmy Broom. Jimmy? Well, yeah, my dad'll be all right now. <sighs> Geezer's meant to be like Richie Scott with stubble. You've been at my lawyers behind my back? No, because it weren't like that. Who do you think you are, hey? I'm the only one trying to help my dad. <sighs> Listen, there's things you don't know about, things you don't understand. Yeah, yeah but I do understand. They'd do anything for you lot. He worships you, my mum says. Listen, I told Billy I couldn't help him. That should have been the end of it. Well, I had to do something. He's my dad, Phil. <laughs> hey, Billy Mitchell, he's not your dad, all right? You ain't got a clue. What? Watch out, Freddy's about! Well, why not, mate? <laughs> Fuck off! Hey, Freddy, I've been texting you all day. Oi! Oh, hey. All right, Dad. Oh, are yeah. Cos I'm just peachy. Apart from the fact that you've all been lying to me. Freddy, are you all right? Well, you've all been laughing at me behind my back and all. That stupid little Freddy believed that Billy's his dad. Let's take his time, his help, his love. Let's take his money. No, look, we haven't. We, we just... We just what? Cos you're a liar that's running out of liars. Uh, look, I don't know what's going on here, but I ain't never hitting this cafe, all right? We were going to tell you, Freddie. I, I promise we were just looking out for you, you know? <gasps> Please, stop. Stop with this boring, goody two-shoes act. You're a liar, just aye, like everyone aye, else. Aye, don't talk to my auntie like that. Oh, now you're worried about me hurting her feelings, your real aye. family's feelings. Aye. Aye. I think you'd better leave, eh? Yeah, and now... Come on, Freddie, let's go.
Bob, I'm sorry for going AWOL and missing my shift at the chippy. It's fine. So, did you find out why everyone's been saying Billy's your dad? I'm as in the dark as you are, mate. Uh, when I was a baby, I lived with my mum and another man, and uh, she told him he was my dad, but he wasn't. For real. I was too young to remember any of it, but I know that it hurt my real dad a lot. And why'd she do it? She died. I, I never got to ask her. But Jane, my adoptive mother, looked after me. Families don't ever lie to hurt us, even if it does. Maybe your mum has a really good reason. Maybe everyone does. But like what? I just know that Billy Mitchell is a good man. Isn't any man would be proud to have a son like you. What about my real dad? So where is he? Why is no one telling me? That's, that's up to your mum, isn't it? And I'm just meant to bowl around not really knowing who I am. But you don't have to know who your dad is for that. It's easy for everyone else to say, though, ain't it? Family is, is, is not just about your mum and dad. You know, you, 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 you've got to surround yourself with, with people who, who will look out for you. And, and you do the same back for them. And trust me, you have got a lot of people looking out for you. Now, I was married to your mum. So I've seen what it means to be a slater. And trust me, that, that mob, they'd kill for you. Your mum's done an amazing job bringing you up. And I know I'm not, not your real dad, but... I always wished I was. And now, now I know you, I still wish I was. Daytime drinking hangovers are the worst. I've gone drunk and sobered up three times in one day before. No, I'm here for you. If you need anything. We make our own families, right? Maybe you should give your mum a bill. I think I've learned enough secrets for one day, don't you? What about, you know, your real dad? I'm just not interested right now. Because you're right. I've got family. <laughs>